hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Feel like I'm out here by myself, but I'm not alone Cause I don't, don't mean shit, cause I got it on With a bad bitch, think she it, but she got it wrong Love it now, she calling on my phone I was destined for this shit, like He got away with it But he ain't get away with it You already know what it is, man Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc, etc But don't let none of that get too far ahead of you You know who I be, follow me on IG, Vida underscore fly Tell your mama I said hi, salute to the whole Notification gang, all of y'all, man, and my brother Showtime SP. Let's get right to the top picks. Top picks, not the top picks, but the topics at hand. It's a lot going on in battle rap right now. This is like an everyday thing. It just keeps moving. It's a repetitive cycle, and I must say this. Uh, shout out to all the leagues out there, all the artists out there. Y'all make this fun. Y'all make this interesting. Um, <laughs> so I wake up today. And I'm scrolling down my timeline, you know what I'm saying? After I wake up, I brush my teeth, let the dog out, things like that. And I scroll my time. It's like the it's like the morning newspaper, you know what I'm saying? When you got different people that you rock with in the culture, artists, promotion. So I scroll down my timeline, right? Get to the point. All right, I'm getting to it, man. Let me, let me, let me. Can I walk him to it? Let me walk him to it. That's what I do. Um, so John John makes a post, right? And this is all... Now NDA is taking over battle rap, you know what I'm saying? Like everybody's talking about NDA, 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 you know what I'm saying? Is it good to have an NDA? Is it bad? Blah, 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 blah. And here's my stance. I've said it before, but some people, I don't understand. So let me get to this point real quick, right? Some people be still in my comments asking me this shit, right? I've said a hundred times at once. I don't care if it's easy. I don't care if it's uh, Jay-Z. I don't care who it is. If it's in battle rap and it's an NDA, this shit is whack. I don't fuck with no NDA. I don't want to hear nothing about it. I'm not jacking that. I've said it. I don't jack that. If you telling me I can't talk about this, can't talk about that, can't mention this, I'm not doing that. I'm not going for it. I don't want to hear about it. I'm not with that whole premise because it takes away from battle rap. I done seen niggas stand in front of some of the craziest material ever. You know what I'm saying? I done seen Tay Rock stand in front of, you don't ride with your niggas. I seen Danny Meyer stand in front of Mike P second round. I seen people stand in front of all type of material. You know what I'm saying? I done seen Rum Nitty had to stand in front of self checkout. I done seen niggas have to stand in front of all type of bars. So I'm not jacking it. I don't know why people, I don't even know how this even becomes a thing. Like there's nothing to jack here. Like it's no, no, no. I understand when they say you can't talk about the price of the battle, where the battle's gonna be booked things like that. But when I'm seeing paperwork that's sent out and I'm hearing stories of the paperwork that's sent out, I ain't get it because I'm not asking for it. I don't want it. You know what I'm saying? Don't send it to me. I ain't, I, I'm good. But when I'm hearing the stories and I'm seeing what's coming out of it and what people are saying, you can't muzzle anybody. But I always thought it was weird because uh, when I heard from Piper Boy, the first thing I said is, I said, he sent you this? I was like, no. I was asking. I said, yo, ain't no way. Because when I seen the verbiage that was in the joint, I was like, hell no. Like, bro, y'all not gonna get off with that. I'll say this. Um, so John John Adam, when I was scrolling down my timeline, he he he, you know, him and Easy got their thing, you know what I'm saying? John John, I'm sure that's a battle that he would want to take. They was talking about battling for some money at one time too. Um, I don't know if that's gonna happen, but we'll see. So he says, since I was told I couldn't rap about it, I'll just leave this here for a reminder. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Help the bear. And he posts a little clip of, you know, the fight when uh, T-Top fell and knocked everybody down like bowling pins and cleared the whole damn stage or whatever the case may be. So I said, you know, I thought that was a, that was a little shot, you know what I'm saying, a little, little, that was just a little jab, you know what I'm saying, a little, just a little bow, a little jab, just a little jab, you know what I'm saying, it's a jab at T-Top and it's a jab at Easy, it's a double entendre jab, it's a pow, pow, pow. So I'm like, alright, cool, you know what I'm saying, and it was only up for like, I don't know if it was a half an hour or an hour, but it had like 200 something comments, I said, oh, hey. So, you know, I clicked the little view comments joint, and the pinned comment is none other than Beasley himself. 
you know, Beasley has some petty gene in him, you know what I'm saying? He's been petty in the past, and he has a way of doing it, you know what I mean? He hasn't been like, he ain't like petty all-star this year, you know what I'm saying? He's been, you know, they've been busy, they've been having events and shit like that, they got lawsuits and shit, they got all type of shit going on. So he ain't been in his super petty bag, but in, in past years, he has. He came out, hit a petty three today, he says, no NDAs in the URL. Say whatever you like. We don't restrict artists from expressing themselves on stage. Summer Man is 13. Now sign URL TV. Now, the, the Easy and Remy and whoever whoever constructed this whole NDA thing and thought that it could be a thing that could be brought to Battle Rap, you have to be understanding that now this is what's going to come out of it. People are going to take shots at you. You should expect to hear that in bars. People are going to be saying shit about it. Because nobody's rocking with it. Now, uh, John John Don has T-Top coming up. I think it should be a pretty exciting battle. But I wanted to know if they were going to be super serious about it because I know they're friends off the court. But hopefully when they come together and put their energy forth, it'll be what it is. But I know John John Don is not the type of person who will play with anybody. You know what I'm saying? He just battled Jay Mills. I felt like he won. I know people was trying to skew the story. Like, oh, it was a debatable. Oh, he might not. It wasn't the only thing to debate was whether Jay Mills was 2-1 or 3-0 for John John, you know what I'm saying? I know I seen Jay Mills on um, Emerson Kennedy's joint. And I, I do, I will say this, I do respect the maturity, you know what I'm saying? I do respect his improvement as far as like in battles and shit like that, Jay Mills, and I see, you know, he's starting to get it, you know what I'm saying? Some people get it a little bit later than others. It took Reed a minute to get it, you know what I'm saying? But he's got it now. And you know, Jay Mills is one thing I will say, he ain't quitting. He gonna keep on showing up, he gonna keep on battling, so if he keep on battling, I just hope to see him get better, you know what I'm saying? But he said he feel like I don't fuck with him more. I do fuck with you, I just want you to be good. That's the thing, it's different. I don't want you to come out here, you know what I'm saying, on a max deal, like a Harden, get a max deal, come out here and you averaging 11 points, you know what I'm saying? And they be like, oh, the assist. Oh, Harden has a bunch of assists, nigga, he not scoring. We know you for scoring. Mills, I knew you from scoring back in the days. If you gonna do this shit, do it at a high level. Let's get back to the topic. So. Uh, they have to know that when you send this type of stuff out to people, you leave yourself open and susceptible to everything. Jesus sent the flood. Uh, so yeah, Beasley's like, no NDAs in the URL, say whatever you like. We don't restrict artists from expressing themselves on stage. And then John John responds and said, T-Top said the battle is off. I did. <laughs> so that's not true. <laughs> shots fired. <laughs> Gotta expect the shots fired at y'all. I don't know who, uh... Somebody told me uh, that I should have got this, you know what I'm saying, and I will get it, you know what I'm saying. This is for it's my, my bruised and battered L. No NDAs in battle rap. Get them shits out of here, especially ones that say what you could talk about versus what you can't. Them shits, get that shit out of here. I don't want to hear nothing about it. Um, they, what, now it's coming out that Diz didn't even sign this shit. I saw, <laughs> Yo, you can't even <sighs> buy the Battle of the Bay pay-per-view. Buy, buy the BOVX GTX pay-per-view. Y'all get the pay-per-view, man. Cause if this is these are the lengths that people y'all are going to arguing and fighting, it's been like, bro, this is the biggest story out of the damn event. It's the biggest story. This they're not even talking about the battles, you know what I'm saying? It's the biggest story of the whole event. The premise of this of, of this pay-per-view being sold shouldn't have to be drama and, and yada yada yada. Now people say, oh the bloggers this, the bloggers that, but they watch them though. You watch them. How do you know what I'm saying? Like y'all are watching us. Now, I said this before. Do I feel like Diz got back into a corner? Yes I do because the foul shit that I was saying about the whole thing was he said when he first got the contract or they did the contract for the battle, he wasn't hit with the NDA. They started promoting it. They started getting people involved, excited, anticipating, talking about the battle. And then, like a couple weeks, or I don't know how long. Please don't quote me, boy, because I ain't said shit. He got hit. He, the NDA got slid to him. Like, oh yeah, why you at it? Good promotion, great battle coming up. But yo, I need you to sign this. If you don't sign this, we can't do the battle. You know what I'm saying? That's that's how it went. That's what he's saying. But there's been so many lies thrown back and forth that you know one person is saying that he was told this and the other person was saying that and now it's just to a point where I would love to get to the actual battles. I would love to get to the actual events and talk about shit like that that's going on because I ain't fucking with the NDA shit. I done said this shit before a hundred times. I'm not I'm not gonna keep saying it. I'm not gonna keep saying it. But uh yeah. So that's that. But John John definitely took his opportunity to throw a shot and have Beasley back him up. That's a, that's a, that's a good shot, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even know, it was a pretty good shot. 
Um, but we'll see if uh, if if a shot is fired back. You know, it's Easy's birthday today. Happy birthday, by the way. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But drama and shit like that, it, it's being talked about. You know, you the algorithm. When you are the algorithm, this is what you get. When you're the number one topic, you're the number one guy. To whom much is given, much is expected, much is tested, and you are being currently tested. I see you going back and forth with Geechee Gotti, you know what I'm saying? Y'all had a, a very interesting back and forth yesterday, you know what I'm saying? More shots fired. Y'all niggas is just wild, you know what I'm saying? I seen, he says, Geechee says, an NDA about not disclosing business practices is understandable, but not being able to talk about anything that pertains to the nigga you rapping against, all parties involved, or even persons that the person met is goofy as hell. It's exactly what everybody's saying. So easy response it says, and the fact that you know that's not the case is goofy as hell. Y'all really nutty. Uh, and then it goes on to say, uh, so the papers is out there. Where does it say he can't talk about shit? And then Geechee Gotti says, section 2A, you mean to tell me you were smart enough to put a Confederate flag in front of your trap house, but can't comprehend some sh you sent out? Yeah, the 16th, you finna be up there looking stupid. And then, uh, you know, they're just going back and forth and back and forth, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's been a, but like I previously said, when this is introduced into battle rap, you have to take everything that comes along with it. Sometimes we gotta think these things through. Like, if is, is this something that I should be introducing? You know, because I, here's the deal. There's no way whoever drafted this up or thought this or sent this out thought that it was gonna stick in battle rap. Niggas talk. They, they everybody gonna be saying something like, "What? We're not doing that." Now, I, like I said, I, have I heard about situations where how much an artist got paid and things like that and locations of the event and the actual battles of the card being held behind restriction? Yes, because people talk. A nigga will find out a card and tell everybody the same day. Or they'll find out where the event is gonna be held tell everybody the same day. So I understand in that regard. But anything other than that, oh no. So they're going back and forth about that. And then you got Calico's interview on Hip Hop Is Real. Shout out to Hip Hop Is Real and everything that they do very important media entity out here. They go, they get the interviews, they get to sit down, they ask the questions, and they shake up shit sometimes. They be ruffling feathers. They'll ask about, you think, <laughs> there's like a couple of events going on. <laughs> there's Max Out, there's Summer Madness, there's uh, the Trenches, there's all of these fucking events going on in the next month or so. They are going to ask everybody who will want to speak about it about that shit. They're gonna ask every, they're asking everybody. They're gonna ask Head Ice, they're gonna ask Rex, they're gonna ask every nigga with an opinion, you know what I'm saying? So that's gonna be the running thing. But Calico's got an interview with Hip Hop Is Real where he's talking about the Briz situation. He's basically saying at this point, Briz is scared. Like he's scared, like literally scared to battle Mook at this point. He said he's seen him more than once when he went to go shake his hand. He was kind of like reluctant, but then he shook it. And he said he's seen T-Top in multiple times after the fight. T-Top went right back to getting money. He's saying Briz hasn't battled in four years. Like, he, Calico is really, 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 Briz, Calico, Calico's wildin' on you. I'm not even gonna, not even gonna hold you. Calico is wildin'. But the thing is, Briz caused this shit, though, by not battling for four years. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've been said, you're gonna stand in front of that. I don't care if he don't rap for another 10 years. If he chooses to battle again, he's gonna stand in front of that round. Whoever it is. You're gonna, you see, don't, don't buckle up, cause you don't ride with you, you're gonna stand in front of that. <laughs> and you can't move the goalposts, you're not gonna be able to change the location, and y'all wanna battle in one of them COVID rooms where it's only me smack and move, that shit's not gonna happen, you know? Is COVID over? No, but it's been minimized to the point where niggas is on planes and in events and shit, so that way, that time passed, you missed that time. That whole time frame is over, you're not gonna be able to get none of that back. But, Cal is wilding on you now. He's wilding on you now, and I know that Mook is, I mean, Briz will probably come back out and do a video and explain what's going on or whatever the case may be, and I've been hearing that he's been edging to come back to Battle Rap, but at this point, like I said, you got uh, one, two, three, you got four years. Like I said, my, my boy was crawling when that fight happened. He's in kindergarten now. That's how long it's been. I promise you, I don't, I, it's for real. It's been that long of a time, but... You know, go watch Calico's interview on Hip Hop Is Real. Uh, y'all let me know. Y'all join the comments, join the comments. Let me know what you think about Beasley, you know, getting involved. Uh, you know, he don't really get involved with everything that goes on. But you gotta know, whoever put this together, 
you have to know what don't come out in the wash comes out in the rinse. Y'all put this into the world, so it's what's coming out. I understand people is gonna say, well, he didn't sign it. Why is it so, why is it such a big deal? He didn't sign it anyway. He was given it. That's the big deal. You, okay? Let's, let's make sure that the line is drawn there. The fact that he was given it is a big deal. You know? Why is he given this? What is the premise of this? What the fuck can he talk about? If, and this is, <laughs> <laughs> Y'all got it, man. Salute to everybody out there, man. I, let, let some more. We we need a couple weeks to pass. We need some more events. I would have thought that an event of this magnitude would be what's uh, you know the topic and the talk of the week, but it ain't. It ain't the recaps, the battles. Nobody even cares about them anymore. It's just the drama. Um, like I said, do I feel like Briz, not Briz? Do I feel like Diz was backed into a corner? Yeah, he was trying to sell a pay per view. He had. Two battles on there that the hood, the hood, hood, hood really, 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 really wanted. Him and Easy and Big K versus Rex. He loses any of those battles. He's gonna lose. Say, he loses any. That's how much. There might have been 153 battles on that card. However many there was. But if he loses any one of those two battles, forget about it. Forget about it. I'm telling you right now, there's niggas who would have been like, nah, I'm not copying it. No Rex, no Big K, I'm not doing it. And especially if you'd have lost that easy to block captain battle. But at the end of the day, uh, Diz, you could have dubbed that NDA when you first got it. That's one thing, but I know you wanted to save an event. But I just don't understand how a nigga could come from the East Coast all the way to the West, put their feet up on your desk and be like, this is my house. This is what we're doing over here. Like, this is what we're going to do. You're going to not do this. You're going to do that. You're going to pay me this. And I'm going to take the battle and put it on my website. I'm going to get the rights to it. I'm going to start selling the shit for $7.99. Whoa, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. You good with that? All right, cool. So we're going to do the battle. Then a couple weeks later, like, all right, now you got to sign this too. Dog, no, who's the god tier here? Who is the god tier? <laughs> who's the legend? I just want to know who's the legend. Who the fuck is the legend if a nigga could come into your house, kick their shoes up on your desk, been here two, three years, and tell you how it's going to go down? That, it's losses on both. It, this L is, is indispensable. It's for, it's for all sides. Because he should have been able to shut that shit down from the door. Like, are you crazy? We're not doing this. But peace, love, blessings to everybody out there, man. I got to go. <laughs> that was good, John. Feel like I'm out here by myself, but I'm not alone Cause I done don't mean shit, cause I got it on What a bad bitch think she it, but she got it wrong Love it now, she calling on my phone I was destined for this shit like it's real